Welcome back to Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel! I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Today, I am using my Spirit Charmers deck against a very good friend of mine. I have convinced her into getting into Yu-Gi-Oh! not too long ago, and she has gotten into Master Duel over the past couple weeks, and she's been sending me everything for every duel she's played, and she plays Destiny Heroes. This woman, Elevere, uh, I believe that's her online name. Her online Twitch link, is, her Twitch link, I don't know why I'm saying online. Her Twitch link is on the screen right now, as well as in the description below. Go check her out, she's a wonderful friend of mine. I hope you will support her. I love her to death, she's amazing. She plays Destiny Heroes. DPE, I made her the deck, mind you, but I hate it so much. She asked me to make her the deck, but I was like, I hate it, I hate it here. I don't want to fight DPE. But today, I am going to take my Spirit Charmers and see if I can beat her DPE. And... I probably won't, mind you, I probably really just won't, but at the same time, it'd be really funny if I did. So let's head on over into our matches and see who the true winner is. A harem or Saint Seiya? That doesn't sound very fair, honestly. <laughs> it has actually been a little while since I've touched Master Duel. I mean, technically, the last time I recorded was the last time I touched Master Duel, but there was like a week difference between when that video was made and when it actually got uploaded. I've been working on a lot of stuff behind the scenes trying to get the next big series done because as most of you probably have, well some of you might not know this actually, my channel will always be Let's Play Focus, that's a beautiful opening hand. Oh, she's first though, I didn't realize that. My channel will always be Let's Play Focus. I much prefer to make, I prefer to tell stories than I do to make one-off videos. And I do love these videos, mind you, but I have been working my ass off trying to get the next series uh, underway and ready to be done. And finally have a lot of it done. We're getting really, really close to being to, for that one to be ready for that series to start production. I just had a stroke, and I'm very excited. Um, I hope you guys will join me on that series, because I'm, I'm looking forward to it. It's one of my favorite games of all time, and I love it dearly. Very, very much so. That's an unfortunate starting hand for me. She started with Ferris in her hand and Malicious. So she can just banish this, get her Malicious out, whatever else she needs. Ooh, no, not Destiny Hero Malicious. Not monkey dick, man. <laughs> I know there's the whole, like, evil hero thing. But why isn't it just straight up called, um... Whatchamacallit? Why isn't it just straight up fucking... Villain. <laughs> Destiny villain thing, whatever, right? Wouldn't that just be easier? Oh, beautiful draw there. What am I gonna get rid of? I suppose I should get rid of dark. Because I have two darks. So let's activate this. We'll send dark away. So let's give myself my other Awakening of the Possessed, because I want both onto the field. Very strong to have. I'll activate Awakening of the Possessed from my hand. This will do things. Then I'll activate other Awakening of the Possessed from my hand. This will do other things. Why did the chain take so long? Now I'll activate Grand Spiritual Art Ichiden. Now I'll Normal Summon Familiar Possessed Win. And I get to draw one card by activating the effect of my Awakening of the Possessed. That... <laughs> yes! No more! No Fusion Destiny or Fusion cards for you! Floodgate! <laughs> I feel bad. Goodbye, Dasha. I think I shut her out for now? I don't think she's able to do anything? Let's activate Unpossessed. And let's activate Possess Partnership. And we can bring out my Dark the Dark Chama and draw one card. Come forth, hentai protagonist! Destroy her vision hero, Vion! I just don't want it there. Nothing else to it. Now I get to draw a card. Give me something good, please. Harpy's by that. Okay, that's not what I wanted to draw, but alright, I'll take it. Draw one card. Luna! Okay. Lina! Sorry. <laughs> I love Lina. Familiar Possessed Lina's premium gold art is my favorite card art in Yu-Gi-Oh. I love that card. Okay, now we get to draw once more. And hopefully get something. Well, alright. Let me just activate this. I mean, I might as well. I don't want to be too cheesy. Just stop her from playing the game outright. Now we can do this and just beat the hell. She still lives though, I believe. So that's alright. Monster effect is negated, but not spell or uh, trap effect. That's nice. Well, it's just spell. I want to give her a chance to play. You have 350 HP, Ella. Let's see what you can do. I'm going to get fucking DPE. 
She's gonna have just drawn Fusion Destiny. She's gonna activate some bullshit. It's gonna fucking ruin me, and I'm gonna cry. This is Fusion Destiny. This is Harpy's Feather Duster. She was just being patient. I'd cry. I'd fucking cry. Oh no! She can't do anything. That's unfortunate. Okay, I give her. I give her one more turn. I give her only one more. Let's just hope she drew what she needed to draw. Because she's in draw phase and it's like, you want to do things. So I imagine she drew something helpful there. No! She could have put some fucking Mirror Force or something in this deck for all I know, to be fair. So it's not necessarily like a loss. But I am going to special summon this one. And then go to attack with Lina. And head on over to game two, I think. Take the L! Take the Ella! Take the Ella! Take the Ella! How's it feel? How's it feel? I ga I came up with the joke! You stole it! I took it back! <laughs> so dumb. It's gonna mean nothing to anyone, but that is literally the fucking motto that we have. I will go first once more. Actually, I didn't go first last time. Never mind, not once more. But I'll go first and hope to draw something good. There's a big possibility I can get something good here. Or I could get fucking nothing at all. Ooh, Drill Dark. Drill Dark is very strong. I'm gonna activate my Unpossessed right here just to give me a bit more protection. Oh no! What's happening? I hope I don't get Predator Plant Verde. Oh. Uh... <laughs> I hate it here. I want to go home. Well, it is what it is. Oh my goodness, DPE! How'd that card get there? <laughs> I gotta hope that I get something helpful. I think the best card I could probably draw next is Spirit Charmers. No! No! Don't kill my dark! Or actually, she's probably, if she gets rid of Unpossessed here, then I'm gonna be, I'm gonna cry. Don't get rid of Unpossessed, please. No! She's Giga Brain. Haha! -ha! I don't take damage! I still get destroyed. I imagine she might main phase two set some cards. I don't think these are all monsters in her hand. Nope, she's straight up end phase. Okay. Huh. Maybe there's nothing that can be used this turn. That blows! Okay. That really blows. Because now she can just, whatever I set or activate here, just bubbity boobity it. Bubbity boobity all of it. And that would blow. Let's normal summon. And I'll end my turn. I'm sure she'll activate it. Oh. Oh, no fucking shot. That's... That sucks. Drill Dark again. She had all three Drill Darks in her starting hand. Wow. Because when she used Fusion Destiny, she sent Drill Dark from her starting hand. Not Dr. D. Dr. D's nuts. Oh. Did you guys know? It snowed. It snowed by me. It's, well, it's not snowing. Was it, was it snowing yesterday? I don't think it was snowing yesterday. But it snowed. It was snowing yesterday morning. Yeah. It was snowing in November. I haven't seen snow since January. I haven't seen snow earlier than January since like 2007. Since I was five years old. I love snow. I love winter. Christmas time is my favorite time of year. I... I'm so happy! It was snowing. It was so pretty. And it was just like non-stop snowing for like a full fucking 18, six, 17, 18 hours. I'm, I don't know why I said six. I was going to say 60, but that's not a number. Well, it's, it is. It is a number, just not one now. My brain just had a stroke. Oh. You're hurting me, Ella. Please. Uh, that's Dynatag's effect, right? Do I just die here? I don't die here because I can special summon um, Rosenryu. And that's not a, that's not a thing. I should just be able to do that. Okay, I'll be fine. Gigabyte gets destroyed. I activate Gigabyte effect. This will allow me to special summon out my Ronryu. Okay, my Ronryu. In defense position. When Ranryu was destroyed by battle or card effect, I could special summon one monster with 1500 attack or defense in my graveyard and special summon that. So I do this. Now I can bring... Oh, that did piercing. And I can bring my Ranryu's effect and bring back out my Gigabyte. Gigabyte's not a hard one for turn, so I can use this now to special summon out again for my deck. Which also thins it pretty nicely. 
And I should end up with a monster on my field at the end of this, too. Because now I use its effect once more, and I don't have anything I can really chain into, but I guess getting an Inari Fire here is nice. Although this is some bullshit, for real. You don't gotta hurt me like this. You could let me go. You could mama mia let me go. Da, 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 da. Oh, please, not decider. So long as I don't die to DPE. Okay, I'm not dying to DPE. I'm cool with this. I'm cool with this. Fuck you, Jolt. Damn, that shit hurt. That shit felt like I got pinched. I don't like getting pinched. I don't have a good pain tolerance. All right, let's hope for a better hand. What the fuck is this? What? What the fuck is this shit? What in the fucking am I supposed to do? I end my turn. I end my turn. Are you on God straight for real serious right now? Can you guys tell me in the comments below actually, what card is he eating? Cause I'm pretty sure it's an actual monster, right? So what is the name of the monster that Nefarious or Archfiend, Eater of Nefariousness, is eating? I do have at least something of a strategy here. If... Oh, it says my stats when it's face down. That's weird. If my card here is destroyed by her battle or card effect, I can special summon it in my next standby phase. I believe it's not the second one, right? Yeah, I can special summon it in my next standby phase. So then I can normal summon out one of my rats, use my Awakening of the Possessed, special summon into a Link, and I should be fine in that regard. Oh, Plasma? I don't know if she could just go through any card in her deck. Oh, deck reward or that is banished. Take literally any of your destiny hero mon monster. Mar ba 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 I hate deny her stupid fucking haircut. Ella, please! Okay. You know what? That works. I draw? Oh, yeah, that's very helpful. Okay. I. Okay. I'm scared. I'm fearful. Oh, I get to draw hand. Well, I don't have anything. Fucking, what are you talking about, Master Duel? Now she has plasma in her hand. That's dangerous. Let's activate terraforming, and we'll give ourselves grand spiritual art each you didn't. So we're a little bit safer. Then we can activate Harpy's Feather Duster, and get rid of whatever her back row is. Uh, what the hell was that? Is that Dr. D? It was Dr. D. Why did you set that? Maybe it was just like a bait thing. Uh, activate Grand Spiritual Art, Ichidin. Then we can activate Awakening of the Possessed. And also we can set Unpossessed over here. What is in your graveyard, dear friend? Dark Monsters. I don't have those. Flip Summon. Uh, Ifinari Fire. That's the name. I almost forgot. Now I special summon this bastard. And we can Blink Summon into a Hita. I... I don't know if I regret Hita being prismatic or not. Because I kind of like the others just being normal shiny. But I don't think the prismatics generally look good in Master Duel. I think Hita's does. Because, you know, it's, the red mixes well with the crystalline colors. But aside from that, I don't think it's that cool looking thing. Cool looking of a thing. If I do this, I want to redo this effect real quick. One special summon, one level four lower monster. It's not a level four lower monster, right? Okay, so now we'll set possess partnerships. Uh, then go battle phase and just get rid of. We'll get rid of Ferris because we don't want that on the field. And I believe we get rid of. Uh, Denier is going to be useful either way. We'll get rid of Draw Hand because it gets banished. Now I'll end my turn. Does that count? No, you actually have to tribute it, right? It's not a special summon for Plasma? I don't believe Plasma is a special summon. Let me go back and look, actually. Must be special summon from your hand by tributing three monsters. That's right. Would that be negated because I have Ichidin? Ah, oh, not linking! I hate it here. Oh, yeah. Activate your effect, Ella. Activate your effect, Ella. Activate your effect, Ella, you foolish one. Yeah. I don't have a monster for 1,500 defense. 
I'm gonna fucking kill myself. I always forget that Ichiden is 1500 defense requirement and not the 1850 minimum attack or the 1850 original attack like the other cards. Why is it different? You know what? It's a good. It's not a good. It's not a good. I hate it. I really despise it. She's definitely smart enough to know that or to see that getting rid of my fucking front row is not that big of a deal. I get to special something out if she destroys Hita. If Hita gets destroyed by battle even, I get to bring something out. Fuck. Jumping monsters can't be destroyed by battle with this, right? Damn. Oh, brother! That's unfortunate! Fucking ouch. Activate on... Uh, let's activate Hita effect first. And then we can activate on Possessed. And we'll actually have something going on here because we will have what's it called uh possess partnership on our field the special summon whatever is in my hand back out onto my field so let's use dark here and bring him out i know ella actually hates this guy for some reason and then we use Hita's effect to give myself my familiar possessed hita is that how that works i thought it was if this card oh it's 1500 or less defense i thought it was one fire spellcaster launch with 1500 or less defense oh my god hold on if she goes to battle phase, I can get rid of her uh, her Destiny Hero DPE real quick. And he won't be able to come back because I'll have a monster with 1500 defense on my field. So Grand Spiritual Art Ichiden will negate his revival effect. Yeah. Come on, Ella. Come on, Ella. Come on, Ella. Kill me. Go battle phase. Fight me, coward. <laughs> nice. She's going into the next phase. We'll activate Possess Partnership. Okay. Special summoning from my hand, my Hita. Because I have two or more different attributes, I can destroy one card in the field without targeting it, being her DPE. Now it's there, she's going to activate the effect of her DPE to keep it all back on the field, and it'll get negated! Yeah! Manual negates! The giga-braining. The giga-braining. The strategy, the gears turning. Waifus are better than Saint Seiya confirmed? I'm just saying shit. And Dark's not even a waifu to be fair, so does this really count? Harems are better than Saint Seiya. That's cringe. I hate it here. Have I destroyed a monster with Unpossessed? I have, so we're not using that. I just said no. No! We're drawn to Waking of Possess, please. Are we going to possess? Are we going to possess? That's all right as well. You know, that could have been a lot of things, but that was pretty good. That was a, a pretty good one. What the fuck is in my... Oh, possessed Partnership! I always forget possessed Partnership effect. We get rid of my possessed Partnership by banishing it. And then we can special... Well, not special. We can set face up in our spell and trap zone. One possessed spell or trap from our thing. In this case, our Awakening of the Possessed. Now we can normal summon area. And because we have Awakening of the Possessed on our field, we can draw one card. Fairy Tale Tales. Actually, I will just activate it here because it's just helpful. Having more setup. Uh, and you know what? Just that, uh... Just because I kind of have to. Just because I have to bring out the card she hates. We can bring out Familiar Possessed Dark. Dark the Dark Charmer, Gloomy, my boy, the hentai protagonist himself. And take her destroy our Phoenix Enforcer. Why does this happen so often? Dark takes DPE too fast. This is my card now, Ella. <laughs> yeah! I can't actually destroy anything with it. Let's go battle phase. Uh, just attack with Dark. The reason I can't use DPE's effect to destroy anything uh, is because DPE's effect, when it gets sent to the graveyard, will be sent to her graveyard, and she will be able to respawn it with her effect. Now let's go attack phase. One more into there. Please and thank you, be very good. And 2450 into you. That's game? I can't do math. How is 3100 and 2450 5500? It is. It is. It was more by 50. I can't do math. I can't do math. Am I serious? Am I okay? 3 plus 2 equals 5. 4 plus 1 equals 6. Plus 0. 0.5 equals 6.5. 56.5. I can do math. What's wrong with me? Why couldn't I do it? Am I okay? 
Okay, again, big shout out to my friend Ella for joining. You are wonderful. I was super fun playing with you today for this video. Thank you for joining me. Uh, again, her links are in the description below. She's a Twitch streamer and a VTuber. I uh, look forward to her content coming out because she's so much fun and is such a wonderful human being. Uh, please, please, please give her all the support you can. And if you have any tips for her on how to play this deck a little bit better, uh, leave in the comments below. Don't be rude about it, obviously. We all just want to have fun. But also, she's learning the game. And I think this could be a good opportunity to learn a little bit more from people that actually know how to play hero decks, which isn't me. I built that deck in like 40 minutes. <laughs> and stuff has been added to it since. I will see you guys next time.